Hello, today we're going to focus on demand for insurance, specifically a full insurance case. In this case, we have a $100,000 home value and a $40,000 loss given a 20% chance of a storm occurring. Also, we have 20 cents per dollar of insurance coverage. This consumer faces a utility function of LN of C, or the natural log of consumption. This means they have a risk averse preference towards losses. In this case, we're asking how much Bob, this consumer, will consume in the good state of the world, given that they purchase insurance. So let's take a look real quick. We can identify that we're a risk averse individual based off of our utility preferences. The natural log of consumption would fall under risk aversion. This means we will be on the top row. Additionally, we have fair insurance given that the insurance premium is equal to the expected loss or the chance of the loss occurring. This means we will be in the middle column. That means we'll be right here under full insurance where the loss is equal to K or the amount paid for insurance and consumption in the good state equals consumption in the bad state. With this in mind, we can use our consumption in the good state formula to figure out how much we will consume in the good state. Consumption in the good state is equal to my starting income minus the premium I pay for insurance times the amount of insurance coverage. Plugging in our numbers, we can say that consumption in the good state is equal to my $100,000 minus my gamma or 20 cents times the amount that I cover against or K, which in this case we know to be 40,000 because we are fully insuring against our loss. This leaves us with consumption in the good state of the world being 92,000, or answer choice D.